Hey everybody, welcome to the Showbo Sam YouTube channel. Today we're gonna be getting into the Satio Security map. A new console mining map slash uh yeah console mining map. Um it's for all platforms. Although this Dodge Ram is not on all consoles. Um it's just a, this is a PC mod that I use. Um I just like using so yeah let's get into it so today oh hey hey spike i'm sorry buddy um let me pet you real quick i apologize all right i go home and i'll be back later all right all right buddy <laughs> i forgot all right well yeah um so let's get into it let's uh head on down to the mine and uh get some console mining done um i think you'll enjoy this map it's pretty cool so Tiro Security is the name of the map. I think I'm pronouncing it right. If I'm pronouncing it wrong, I'm sorry. I apologize. But uh, let's see here. I'm about to pull this map up because I still don't quite know where I'm going. Um, all right, that's pretty simple. As you can see, the mines at the top of the map. I really like this Dodge Ram. I think it's the coolest thing on earth. It's jacked up all high. I wish it was like an any level. You just raise and lower that wheel but it's cool they need to bring something you know different like this to console but it's, it's a process you know pc is just like you can get whatever you want so there's the fuel station so i think my turn's right here i believe what is this guy doing uh you want to mess around huh all right let's see here this my turn yep my turn so yeah you take your second left and follow it on down and you'll run right into the mine it's a nice little hike this map doesn't have very many like uh, you know like a little town it's, it's fairly small so um not much going on and you do the same the same process so when you get to the actual mining area you have to purchase the mine before you're able to dig a lot of people always ask me, uh, why can I dig? Well, you got to purchase the purchase the uh, land it sits on first. And it's, on this map right here, that land is fairly cheap. So it's only, uh, I think it was $70,000, I believe it was. And you start with $1.5 million. Yeah, it was only $70,000, as you can see it right up here at the left. So it's at the very top of the map on the right-hand side. If you're looking at the map. And I really enjoy this truck. As you can see, I got kind of stuff off. Um, I've already transported everything here. Let me move this side of the way. Park her over here on the side somewhere. Alright. So you got stone right here that you can... Um, actually, so you can buy the, uh, the processing plant, I believe. Well, no, I just load here. All right, so you would sell it to the rock crusher, um, dump it at the rock crusher, and then you can um, haul it off right here, or you can just side load it like I usually do. I just like side load, and I think that the silos, silos are cool, but I like to like load my own stuff. And as you can see today, I'm using this old Calais loader, front end loader. This is the uh, the biggest one that they have in game. It's a lot smaller than the uh, Volvos, but on um, the 35, I mean the bucket holds like 3,500 liters or whatever, so. You can load fairly simple with this. Um, I mean, some of some of the uh, the loaders have an issue. Thirty C at yeah, thirty five hundred and eight liters. Some of the some of the oh shoot, my bad. Some of the some of the loaders they have an issue with them tipping when you try to load stone. So I'm gonna just grab a scoop of stone. And see if it has a problem with tipping or whatnot. I'm using just a regular bucket. I'm not using like an oversized bucket or whatnot. Some that that may be the issue. Um, a lot of people try to use the end game, uh, the um, the Caterpillar uh, 980K. Yeah, it's like it wants to tip a little bit. Let's see here. Nah, it's all right. Yeah, it holds its own. So yeah, it's good. I mean, if you're trying to turn, you'll probably flip it, but. 
I don't think it'll tip forward or backwards. So you're good in that aspect, yeah. So it holds the stones well, as you can see. So you won't have a problem with this one. But yeah, the 980K, for some reason, you get a full bucket of stones and it'll tip forward every time. But uh, yeah, you can sell the stone, those stones to the debris crusher. Um, like I said, you can scoop everything. You can load it with the loader. Um, everything works. All these machines work. Um, the dozer here. You can kind of level stuff out. You know, push your piles up and whatnot. Get that up a little bit. Yeah, see, see it moving. You can kind of level stuff out. Push your piles up with the dozers. Um, the uh, bob, uh, not the bobcat. The uh, backhoe here. Um, same thing as the loader. It'll load just fine. But if you want to, you know, go a little faster, this only holds uh, twenty. Is it twenty five hundred? Twenty five hundred uh, liters. So yeah, twenty five oh eight. And the other one's the uh, the loader is a thousand more, but oh, she might be a little top heavy. Let's see here. Oh yeah. <laughs> so the bobcat. Well, all bobcats are. Bobcat's a little top heavy, but the trick to it is, I think, we're gonna test it out. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna do a little myth busting real quick before we move on. So, what I think is, when you, when you um, put this bucket full of material, it acts as a weight. So I'll grab some material with the old bucket here. Oh, maybe I need to get a little closer. Oh my god. Yeah, I need to move a little closer. Yeah, when you get this bucket full of material, it acts as a weight kind of. So you see I got the bucket full of material, so I'm gonna fold the back hole back up. And then see how, how it does now. Let's see if it wants to still tip over. You see how it is now? So that that when you put uh, material inside of that bucket, it weights it down, which gives it the uh, the back of the back with more weight, so you won't tip for it like that. See how I'm not tipping for it? I got the same bucket of material that I had before. So yeah, so that's the trick. So you go ahead and fill that bucket up in the back, and uh, you're able to load it however you want, and it works as well too with the stone. So if this was stone, it would be working just the same. So uh, yeah, as you can see, you know, and the back is tall enough to load this dump truck. And uh, so this dump truck's in the mod menu, in-game mod menu, the R back RD. So it's this back row. And uh, this trailer. This trailer's a 30-foot utility trailer, but you can make it a log uh, carrier. You can put this body on it. This is a dump body, which you can hold haul all kind of materials in. As you can see, I got limestone in it. Um, so you make a really good run. You can paint it any color you want. You know, I try to match the truck or whatever. Um, it has a tarp. You can fold the tarp up and down. It's a pretty cool trailer. I like it. Um, let's see if I can. Oh, I thought it moved. I thought it rolled back. Okay, well, yeah, you can tarp it. Whatever. That's pretty cool. Um, and the good old fateful Komatsu, which is always, it's always reliable. Good old Komatsu. Always old reliable. Good old Komatsu. And you can load with the Kamatsu as well. So you got you take your pick, man. I mean, there's other things, skid steers you can load with. Um, take your pick. Like I said, you can dig the stones. Let me go over here and show you that you can dig these stones. And uh, I want to go through all the piles. So some people say, "Oh, I can't dig this, can't do that," and they it's just a simple mistake. They don't uh, they don't buy the land first. And as you can see, I just picked up a old scoop. A rock and I'm just putting it back and all these piles are ready to be hauled out of here and 
I've got a scoop of pile from over here just to show everybody you can pick from every last pile that's back here. And I got another bucket full and I'm just dumping it right back out. So yeah, and uh, like I said, you, um, the stone you can put right here in the, the brie crusher and you can um, turn it into lime and load the lime from the silo right here. Uh, um, where you would sell it is you would have to look here and find out where who has who's buying lime, of course. Let's see here. Let's see if we can't find it. Get this all figured out. So the lime station. So the lime station is let's see. I can go into um I got like flight mode so I can kind of see. So I'll just go into flight mode real quick and um fly up and see if I can't find this lime station. Use the green bean when I tag when you tag somewhere. Pull up the map. See, I don't have a clue. But yeah, that's that's the only place that's buying it. The lime station. Um, I thought I would be able to see that green bean. Um. Hmm. Well. Anyway, you'll figure it out. <laughs> no problem. But yeah, so that's going to wrap it up today for the uh, the new mining map. Satiro Sakuri. Satiro Sakuri. And um, yeah, as you can see, man, this is going to be a lot of fun. Sell it, sell all this stuff. And when you buy it, like I said, it's only 70000 So it's going to be quite profitable, you know, when, you, uh, when you're able to sell all the material. Because that's a lot of lime to sell. And then, you know... The the, um, the actual stone is still still left to crush, and um, I haven't searched the entire map, so I, uh, it might be another place where you can uh, get stone as well. So I might make I might be making a part two, but I haven't really searched the map, so uh, just go from here. But um, yes, it's been another great episode of console mining from uh, Showboat Sam, and uh, don't remember remember to like and subscribe. Um, yeah and have fun with the map man um yeah i gotta also i have a dedicated server open um it, with the uh the hill of b creek farm map and um you can join showboat farms um i got i've made a video on it i've, I've made an actual community post on uh, my youtube channel that has the uh all the info to join if you want to join so everybody's welcome to join it's public so so, yep. So, it's been another great video with the Showboat Sam YouTube channel. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys on the next one. Showboat out. Thanks for watching, man. Peace.